Hi Gemini and welcome to your tarot love readings here. We're going to take a look at the messages coming in for you in relation to love and romance. As always guys, these messages are general, so please just keep that in mind. If you're after a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here. So once again, these messages are intended for Gemini Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising and those cross-watching as well. Okay, you have the Page of Pentacles here that's just flown out. There is some sort of incoming news, some sort of message that will take you by surprise. Some unexpected information is going to be communicated to you, he jemmies. Um, some of you, maybe it is expected. Maybe it's something you've been waiting for. For others of you, I feel like this, this is a message that has a pleasant surprise attached to it. From a younger energy, younger energy here with the Page of Pentacles. So someone, young, someone younger than yourself or it is either this message he has a lot of, there's a lot of enthusiasm and energy surrounding this message or it comes from a younger figure here. So a younger romantic interest or someone who is a little bit younger than yourself. You have the Eight of Pentacles here. You're going to be working on something. You're going to be building something. You might be given an opportunity to repair something here. Okay, Justice, the Nine of Cups, Eight of Wands, and the Page of Pentacles. Now, you've got a lot of earthly energy here that's come up in your spread. Some of you may be dealing with an um, earth, earth sign, sorry, a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn. Um, okay. Whilst for others of you, I feel like there is something that's, uh, you're laying down a healthy foundation or you're building a very sturdy foundation when it comes to a relationship here. And with the Eight of Pentacles, I see a lot of you working on something. You'll have the opportunity to fix something. Um, someone here may come in to apologize for their actions here or apologize for their um their absence someone might have said or done thing or done something to maybe to hurt you here um, or to spite you um, so you'll either receive some sort of apology but I feel like it's more than that it feels like there's something else beyond that so I feel like maybe this person wants to turn around and work on something okay and maybe they might want to work on themselves for the sake of this relationship for the sake of this connection or maybe this person wants to work on you know how the how they will try and treat you better with more respect um, going forward here. They might want to turn around and ask for a second chance. Because I feel like someone is not done with you, he Gemini. And I feel like someone he wants to give this relationship or give this connection another go. Or they want you to give them another go. They, it's like they want another second chance with you. It's like they want to prove themselves to you. So you'll have the opportunity to work through some sort of issues with a connecting energy here or to work on a relationship. Something here is repairable. It's salvageable. You've got something to work with here. It can be repaired. Um, an apology can very well maybe make things right. You can amend this is what I'm seeing. Um, so I'm also seeing that there are two sides though, okay? Um, in working through this, there are two sides to this story here or there are two sides here so you know there is your side to consider but there's also their side to consider so um yeah i feel like for some of you this may be helpful but there are two sides to to the coin to the pentacle here karmic justice here is coming into play um i feel like some of you are getting your i feel like karmic justice here is is playing out for you here you're getting your um What's you're getting your juice here is what I'm seeing for you, Gemini. And also be careful because I feel like the consequences, um, every action has a consequence, every action has a reaction here. So if you're committing to, to a choice or to a decision, just be reminded, Gemini, that you're also committing to the consequence of that choice, of that decision here. Um, and also, it's not in your, for some of you, I'm seeing that it's not in your power to, um, not to judge, but it's not in your power to seek uh, revenge. 
Okay, I feel like the, the karmic laws will balance the scales out. So um, if there is someone here whom I feel like maybe you're wanting to, some of you I feel like maybe you, you're wanting to, you're wanting to seek retaliation. You want to get even with someone. Some of you may be feeling a little bit spiteful. It's not. It's not for you to do. Leave it to you know. You leave it to the laws of karma. Um, they will figure it all out. Okay. Um, and you do have the nine of cups, and this is the um, the wish fulfillment here. Um, I'm seeing there is something here that's coming to fruition, something here that is happening and it's manifesting for you. You will see evidence of this start showing in your life, um, start showing up in your life very shortly, shortly after this reading. You may already see evidence of this in, happening in your life as, you know, I'm doing this reading even prior to this reading here. Um, but there is something here that I feel like you've been really wanting. Um, it could be, you know, a relation, you've been really wanting for a relationship to work. It could be that you've been really wanting to connect with someone or to connect some, with something here it's happening for you and it's putting you in a really good energy it's putting you in a really good state in a really good position here i'm also seeing that for some of you i feel like there there is something here that i feel like you're, it's like you're kind of showing off and you, you're very proud of something here you're very proud of some sort of achievement or you maybe you're very proud you're going to take a look and see just how far you've come with someone or how you might have never given up hope on someone or something here. Because I feel like there's a sense of pride attached to this energy here for you, Jemmys. Okay, and with the Eight of Cups, I am seeing that there is... Uh, sorry, the Eight of Wands. I am seeing that there is going to be a lot of communication. I feel like it's between you and a romantic interest. Um, and I, I feel like this is someone who's very... I feel like they're doing the chasing here. This is someone whom is um, extremely attracted to you, is very interested in you. I see there being a lot of contact, a lot of communication between the two of you. Um, there's quite a flow to this energy here, to this connection. There's quite a flow. I don't see anything disrupting this flow anytime soon either. I'm seeing a lot of growth. Notice the, sprout, um, the sprouting ones here. So I'm seeing, for those of you that are like in a romantic connection, it's very likely that things are really going to pick up the pace. Things are going to start happening really quickly and very... Um, this is going to unfold very quickly and very fast for you here. You may feel as though it's like a whirlwind romance or everything is happening all at once here. But it feels exciting. It feels exhilarating here, Gemini. Just let it happen here. Be in the moment. Stay in the moment. Um, and you've got the Knight of Pentacles here. For some of you, I feel like there's, um, there's a romantic interest here. A, a connecting romantic energy who I feel like you will have... The, um, I feel like it has the potential to go the distance here. I feel like what the two of you are doing now is you're, essen you're essentially creating a very um, stable foundation for the future here. Um, it feels like this is someone who is thinking about things long term. This is someone who is really thinking. Um, and they've thought about this a long time here, Gemini. They've been thinking. They've really thought this through. They've really thought this process through. I feel like this is someone who wants commitment. Um, so it's very likely that this person might open up to you or they may come forward with some sort of um, some sort of plan or some sort of ID um, or they may put forward some sort of proposal or offer to sort of um, lock things in with you, either make it like exclusive, make it official, um, cement a connection. Um, perhaps they may start talking about moving in together, living together, looking for a house, um, buying a house here. But I feel like this is someone who wants... This person sees you in their future and they see just how effortlessly you're able to fit into theirs. And you'll you'll see that this person here is um, at a stage where they're ready for something more. Okay, they're ready for something um, a lot more serious, a lot more um, long term here. That's all I have for you guys. Thank you as always for watching and listening. Please share your support by subscribing to this channel, liking, commenting or sharing. I will be sharing with you more tarot love readings, so do stay tuned. Thanks guys again. Bye for now.